Hey, what's good, everybody? It's your boy Kobe in the mix. Today we're playing Watch Dogs Legions. This is another game series. I hope you guys enjoyed that Mafia series. Um, but today I'm bringing back another series, Watch Dogs Legions. Um, the whole objective of this game is basically you start off as a random character. You know the preset characters that Ubisoft gives you, and basically the whole objective is you got to try to find more people to be with you and fight by your side because I guess you're taking on this group called Dead Sec and it's supposed to be like really powerful and I guess the group I'm in was supposed to be saving the city and we're like the good guys basically um so yeah I hope you guys enjoy the series um also I ended up getting the Xbox Series X so I'm gonna be having some special content for you guys the day that comes out 2k call of duty and etc so yeah it should be really fun so i can't wait well without further ado guys i hope you guys enjoy the series it's your boy kobe in the mix and i'm out ah london what a town history around every corner and a tourist photographing it pub serving up a pint and a smile all that music theater and art and multiculturalism, and the world's oldest underground, the Tube. The class of cities, really, top shelf stuff. Only took 12,000 years to build it up, and one night to tear it all down. What's our status? Perimeter security's down, but plenty of your flying friends about. Fucking hell. Dalton, no time to waste. Yes, ma'am. I'm in. Any idea what we're up against, Bagley? If you haven't brushed off, I might. Ever consider leaving these security threats to the authorities? That's rich, Bagley. The government would sooner arrest us for trying to help than actually do something useful. We'll have to sort this one on our own. Carefully, Dalton. Bagley, are you detecting a little worry in Sabine's voice? Brilliant. Asking the computer about feelings. This explains so much. Shut it, you two, and get to work. There she is. Okay, I took that boy out. That hurt you more than it hurt me. Do us a favor and keep it quiet, Dalton. If they don't shoot me, I won't shoot them. How's that? So we gotta hijack this camera. Got the enemy right there. Explode. Okay, I think we gotta close out of that. Let's make our way towards over there. Oh, okay. All right, so let's make our way towards over here. What do we have to do? Oh, we gotta unlock that. They've got loads of dead set gear down here. 
And why do you suppose that is? What? How did they get their hands on it? I don't know. But someone wants to make it look like DedSec was here. Shit. You need to proceed with extreme caution, Dalton. Who are these men in black, anyway? Nothing identifying. I suspect that's by design. Oh, fuck me. The entire place is rigged to blow. Jesus, those man, canisters. they got explosives all over okay, here, man. Is that... RDX nitrogen. You got this stuff all set up to kill me. Can you locate a detonator, Bagley? Not exactly, but there's a device streaming a fuckload of encrypted data from the floor above you. Yeah, that fits the bill. On my way. Their profiles are heavily encrypted. No identifying information. Oh, ghosts in this system. Bagley, is that not the detonator? No, but it's a transmitter sending a signal to a device on the floor above us. Safe to assume that would be the detonator we're looking for. Man, they take downs, man, in this series, bro. And I mean, in this Watch Dogs Leeds is just so nice. Loving the takedown. Oh my god. My dude must have been an MMA fighter. That Stage boy just gave him the boss. Bombs. Oh my god. These pricks are gonna blow up Parliament and hang it on us. Not if you get to that detonator first. of commons. Whoever these men in black are, they've got brass bollocks to set up in the center of government. I found the detonator. And it's definitely live. Bagley, I'm gonna need some help with this. Yes, you are, but sadly, I'm locked out. Fuck. Well, we don't have a chance without Bagley. Wait, I might know a workaround. We trained in manual overrides at MI5. You're full of surprises. Be quick about it. All right, Bagley, do your thing. I'm in. And the bombs have just armed themselves. Well, that may complicate matters. For fuck's sake. Can you defuse them or not? Of course I can, but I might also trip another failsafe and vaporize you, so fair warning. I expect this to draw some attention your way, Dalton. Oh, I'm counting on it. Company at our back door. Shit. Dalton, we've got some heat here at HQ. How long is this going to take, Bagley? Depends how often you interrupt me with questions. All right, everyone. Bases on, guns out. It's about to get real. They're on me. I'll try and hold them off. They trying to ambush your boy. Nothing to report. Checking elsewhere. Check your doors and corners. Bagley, update. Let's just say I'm both impressed and annoyed by how sophisticated this anti-tamper security is. Still working. <laughs> Mm -hmm. ground. Bagley, tell me you're close. I'm through security. Now waiting through Man. terabytes of decoy code looking for the detonation sequence. Uh. Well, why does shooting feel like this? He should be dead in one hit. To the head? One shot to the head? He's not, he not down? Oh, 
Yeah, the shooting mechanics on here is kind of weird. I gotta get used to it. You would think one bullet to the head, it do. That's crazy. I need your physical appendages now. Who's run? There are three slots on the left. One of them is the receiver. You need to pull the controller wire. Are you fucking kidding me? No, I'm fucking not. Pull the wire. This gets me blown up. Diffused. <laughs> See, that wasn't so bad, was it? Bagley, you bastard. You nearly gave me a bloody heart attack then. <laughs> whoa, 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 what the fuck am I looking at? It appears Parliament is not the only target. More bombs are going live as we speak. On screen, Bagley. Fucking hell, we need to get the word out. Those sites need to be evacuated. They're spread out all over London. There isn't any time. But my sister's at the tone conference. We have to do something. I picked up a transmitter on the roof that is sending out a signal to the other bomb sites. If you can reach it, I can shut it all down. Sabine! Fuck! Dalton, we're breached! Go! The roof! Dang, they trying to ambush my friends. Too. Sabine, I what's going get on? To them and save them. We're being raided. It's a bloodbath. Her protocol is to wipe everything, including Bagley. I need him for the transmitter. I know, but if they get him, they get everything. Names, opt, locations. Okay, I'll do it the old-fashioned way. Wipe him. Yes, wipe me. Do it, Sabine, and get the hell out of there. Bagley's down. You're on your own. Dalton, if this goes... It, it won't. I'll see you at the rally point. I promise. Good luck. So it's gonna take a whole round to kill these dudes, basically. takes a whole round to kill him. <laughs> even when I'm aiming from the head. Don't even matter if I'm aiming for the head. Pause, but that's crazy. Exactly. To save the world. You do know Londoners have died before. Hmm? The plague, the great fire, the blitz. It's not much fun. But destruction is always the cure. And it begins today. Zero day. Oh my god. 
And they just took me out just like that. That's crazy. <laughs> and they already killing my character off at the beginning again. A series of explosions devastated three sites in London. Authorities are asking residents to remain in their homes as the situation continues to develop. We have received no official casualty total, but it is expected. Mourners gathered for a series of candlelight vigils that brought closure to thousands of families and indeed to an entire city. London is now laser focused. They attend Dowling Street, where Nigel Cass, CEO of private military company Albion, received a mandate to secure London. Cass has vowed to hunt down dead set terrorist response. Albion used cutting-edge artificial intelligence systems and autonomous drones to capture the remaining members of DedSec. A stark warning to would-be insurgents. corporations are posting record profits due to increased efficiencies in production and distribution, enabled by the use of technologies initially developed and approved for security purposes. A long overdue cleanup as crime numbers take a dive. Illegal gambling, drug trafficking and prostitution all down following prosecutions of the leaders of four of London's five largest criminal syndicates, the streets of Camden and Brixton. Londoners, as Albion's mandate is extended indefinitely by the government, life finally begins to return to normal. Curfews and travel restrictions have been lifted in all boroughs, thanks to the deployment. Big news outlets, reports of rioting in Trafalgar Square have been greatly exaggerated. Possibly by foreign meddlers pushing a false narrative through social media. Albion is in complete control of a few reprimand the public about the circulation of fake news, conspiracy theories persisting in dark corners of the internet that terrorist group DeadSec were framed for the bombings have been roundly rejected. Our own reporters could not find a single Londoner willing to expound those theories on camera. The facts. So it's dead sex that's terrorizing the whole man city of London. So we gotta take on dead sex, and that's what I'm telling you guys. We gotta try to get more people to join our group to take on that daily group, cause they're trying to take over London, man. We gotta, man, we gotta capitalize and save the day, man. I need to assemble a team, but I can't reboot DedSec alone. Let me break into London CTOS and see who's available. I'm Claire Waters, and we've been discussing the hacktivist, now alleged terrorist group, DedSec, on this week's Buccaneer Radio. I have Colin calling in. Colin, what's your take? Now, I've been saying from the start we should have round up dead sick and thrown them in jail. Now, I'll say they should all be lined up and shut. You don't find it awfully convenient that they've been fingered as the attackers, but we've seen no proof. Look at town! Look at our city! What more proof do you need? Well, Colin, I'd say you have to look at their history of non-violent action. Albion's put more civilians in the hospital in the past few months than dead sick ever has. I smell a scapegoat. Now I have Emily calling in. Emily, what's your take? You're absolutely right, Claire. The government's just framing DedSec because they want to make it seem like they have this under control. They probably have no clue who was behind the bombings. But that doesn't look good on the news, does it? DedSec's been a thorn in their side. Who better to pin it on? Angie, I have you next. What do you make of all this? I think if anything, huh? DedSec showed their true colors. Terrifying to think we harbored such a dangerous element for years. Terrorists in our own backyard. Do you find DedSec more frightening than the different gangs in London like Clan Kelly? Clan Kelly might set your shop on fire and maybe they'd kill you, but even they wouldn't try to blow up all of Parliament. Next, I have Quinto King. Do you feel safer using a pseudonym? is worse than I thought. Ah, uh, but there's a candidate. 
Looks like you're dead sex best hope. They gave me all these ugly ass characters. Oh my god. Who do I want? Um, it's a lot of characters to choose, man. So this is gonna be my uh, first operator that's gonna start off in the group. So this is gonna be my main character until I hire more people to join my group and then you can play as different characters once you have them in your group and you recruit them. But for my first operative, should I go with? She got a sports vehicle though. Mm. She got the sports car, I'm gonna have to go with her. Cause I do need to get around the city. We gonna go with her. Valeria Cooper. Yeah. So this is gonna be our first operator. Should be fun. Glad to see you're alive. If you're still committed to the cause, DedSec needs you. I'll send you the coordinates to our last safe house. Meet me there. Fine. This must be our personal vehicle. Hey, that'd be sexy. The auto drive is? Auto drive now and later. What? Auto drive now disabled. Oh, this boy moving. Auto drive now enabled. Crashes, baby. Excuse me. Yeah, we just got in the way. Oh man, this boy moving. Oh yeah, the streets are different in London. We having traffic coming the opposite way from what we used to in the United States. And the driver's seat is on the right hand side instead of the left hand side. Interesting. I've downloaded a patch to your optics so you can access our security system. It's set up so that I can't just let someone who isn't dead sec in. You'll have to do the manual override. I'm not thrilled about getting my hands dirty, but I suppose one does what one must. Hmm, so what do we gotta do?
Oh, we gotta start right here. Just gonna lock that. One of Sabine's, are ya? I'll see you downstairs later then. In for a penny. Yeah, I take that back. I think we did set, guys. I'm not sure. I'm, we still gotta play the story though. I think we're dead set. I don't know if we're going against dead set. I think we are dead set. So that's that's on me, guys. <laughs> Have no idea yet. I'm not giving you guys false information. Ah, oh, a dank pitch black cellar. Just what I was hoping for. these little collectibles on here. We're not gonna be listening to that. No dead sec registration detected. Identify yourself or I'll seal the exits, hack your tick and read you every drunken email you ever wrote until you starve. I'm with Sabine. Who the hell are you? And why do you sound like a mobile phone? Sabine's alive? Well, that's one piece of good news. I'm Bagley, dead sec definitely not stolen, highly advanced AI assistant. And it seems I've been out of commission for a few months. Anyway, why don't you go connect me to the Dead Set Network so I can become more powerful than you could possibly imagine? What I mean, this? catch up on what I missed. In a wreck. Ah, that's it. I'm reconnected to the network. Downloading our database, news archives, and... Oh, oh, oh. Um. I'm Claire Wolf. Oh, terrorist group DeadSec responsible for deadly bombings in London. Dalton Wolf dead? I leave you people alone for a second and you immediately cock it all up. So, Bagley, if not DeadSec, then who was behind the bombings? There's a gap in my memory after Dalton, well, let's be honest, after I disarmed the bomb at Parliament. I'm missing information about what happened after I was taken offline. But from what I can infer, an unknown hacker group identified only as Zero Day was involved. I believe this Zero Day staged the attacks and framed DeadSec for their dirty work. Come to my terminal. Sabine is requesting a video call. Oh, so we're going against Zero Day. Zero Day was the group that killed our main character at the beginning of the prologue. So we're DeadSec and they're just... Wow. Damn, that's, that's tough. That is tough. So they're framing us for all they fucking dirty work that they're doing. Yeah, we gonna fuck them up when we get to them. Those bitches. Patching in Sabine Brandt now. I suggest you listen very closely to anything she has to say. There you are. I'm <laughs> glad you made it. Backley. God, it's good to hear your demented little voice. Is your memory intact? Not even slightly. The last record I have is of our HQ being raided. My only lead is a group known as Zero Day. Ring any bells? No. But the HQ was attacked by some men in black. The same that were at Parliament. Maybe working together. We didn't stand a chance. They just gunned everyone down. My God. How'd you survive? I managed to escape through the sewers to Camden. A contact smuggled me out of the city, and I've been hiding out in the north since. Prudent. Your profile is red flagged as a high priority target in the city's surveillance system. Even a partial recognition hit would have you hunted down and shot on sight. There aren't many dead sec fans in London these days. Look, I want to help, I do. But joining up with you now verges on suicidal. Listen, if anyone knows anything about risks, it's me. I lost everything and everyone. But it comes down to this. London is in a death spiral. And if DeadSec can't pull it out, trust me, no one can. The city needs a resistance. And it starts with you. What do you say? 
Fine. But you owe me. Excellent. New user registered. Welcome to DedSec. Now, it would be irresponsible of us to release you naked and mewling into the wild. You'll find equipment around the safe house that are essential items in your DedSec kit. Oh, so these tech points to unlock our gadgets and upgrades for like skills, different skills and stuff. Interesting. Different abilities we can unlock. So you gotta get those tech points though. So, and they scatter all around the map. Cool. A sophisticated system for hiding your identity from facial recognition tech it's called a mask and while we're here perhaps we can talk about updating your wardrobe i mean look at you come on Got different mask, huh? Then we'll just go with the original mask for now. You've got all these fancy new toys, but it's also important to know the basics. You need to learn how to throw a punch and how to take one. I'll will escalate if you come at them with a gun and shoot you down. We want to avoid collateral damage. In DedSec, we try to use guns only as a last resort. Boy, she you met Connie Robinson. She owns the pub and is an old DedSec contact, not to mention a champion amateur boxer. Go to the practice ring and she'll show you how to stop flinching when someone cocks a punch at you. I'm about to beat this bitch up with heels. I'll be right down. Could use the warm up. Yeah, there's got a boxing ring in our headquarters. Start with some basic strikes. Hit me. Don't be shy. That's cold. Oh yeah, this game gonna be fun as hell. Under my block. Find the weak point. Couldn't have done that better myself. Just like that. <sighs> Quick on your feet now. You want to create this? Well, he made one of my uncle, man. You're getting it. She going. You're getting it. Yeah, hey, the dodging this, man. The dodging this year, bro, is cold, bro. Like that little fight system they have over here. Almost killed me. Yeah, the fight system's gonna be definitely cold this year. I would have left her on the ground. <laughs> Man. Right, gear in order. Know enough not to punch yourself in the face or get shot for pulling out a gun too early. Brilliant. I'm working out how we find Zero Day and ruin their day, but 
but I need someone with actual legs to do the legwork. Hope you're ready. We have some damage control to do if we want to change the perception that we're a bunch of violent thugs. I'll let you be the judge of how best to handle yourself, but remember, you represent DedSec now. We got a photo booth in here? So we're using the bar as our little safe house again. That's too funny. What's this? She got headphones on her head. I'm trying to see. I can listen. All right, Sabine, what's our plan? Make no mistake, London is under occupation. Armed mercenaries patrol our streets, allegedly to keep people safe, but really they're keeping the people scared. And all our cowering just makes us easier to step on. Albion needs this terror. It's how they consolidate their power. So we have to so ignite the will to resist the people of London by showing them that Albion aren't the solution. They're the problem. For that, we'll need information. I'm pushing two sets of coordinates to your optic. Cheers, Bagley. About to hire people that's I've good, identified and that's two actually going to be valuable to One, the group. We're going to disrupt some Albion propaganda. Remind the people it's not Albion's way or the highway. Two, we need intel about Albion operations if we want to throw a spanner in their plans. You game? How could I say no to you? Brilliant. Let's get the people of London on board. Tell me about him, Bags. Looks like he's a marked man. Clan Kelly put a bounty on his head. Why? He's an underground bare-knuckle boxer, and he's more dangerous and bloodthirsty than a mosquito with malaria. He managed to take down a mob-backed favorite in his last match. Now they're sending out an enforcer to make sure he never wins again. Ugh, only thing worse than a sore loser is a sore loser with a murderer on retainer. Bags, find me that enforcer. Already done. Building a resistance group requires operatives with specialized skills. Technical abilities, firearms handling, and physical training are all valuable. Bare knuckle boxing rings are a good place to find people who are good at throwing punches or taking them. By defeating each opponent in an arena, you'll have an opportunity to face its best fighter. Prove your physical superiority and they may consider joining DedSec. I'm guessing that's some sort of primate society thing. Ooh, it's tech points over here. That's what those green little indi indicators mean. Green indicators. Those are tech points that's gonna get our, our skills up, man. Shit. Mm. Hey, we can use lifts on here. We can hack anything. That's cold.
could climb pipes. <laughs> and that's funny. So that's 10. That's plus 10 tech points. That's going to get our upgrades up. We just got to keep getting those. Those are going to be scattered all around the map. I missed that jump. Hold A to automatically jump over gaps. Yes, nicely done. That'll get people's attention. Let them know someone is standing up to Albion. Light the spark that they can stand up to. If nothing else, it'll relieve their eye strain. What now? You need to steal information about Albion's plans. That will give us what we need to really put the hurt on their operations. It's a new man. This is all new to me. With this traffic, man. Like London, they just be having traffic on the left hand side. I mean, cars going on the left hand side that's going straight, and then from the opposite direction, they be coming from the right. Like in the United States, like this would be, we were supposed to be in this lane, the right hand lane, and then we had traffic coming from the left hand lane. It's like everything's the opposite in London. And you driving on the right hand side, that's man. They really got this down. It really be like that out there. Never live in London. Shout out to my people in London, though. No disrespect, but it's like, man, this is all new to me. I've been getting used to this. That's crazy. Albion have established an operational base in the Royal Court of Justice. First they take over the justice system, then they move in. So much for rule of law. Exactly. But it likely means there's information here about how Albion are targeting dissenters, the who and the why. We need that data if we're going to disrupt their operation. Got a whole weapon, dude. You lame. <laughs> Fucking lame, bro. <clears throat> so what we gotta do? We gotta. So we can hack anything, guys. Crack. What is this filthy rubbish? Okay. Gotcha. <laughs> I'm 
put him in a sleeper hole. Yeah, they're really creative with their takedowns. The legions. Damn. <laughs> oh man. That's tough. I like this. Man. Oh, what we gotta do? We got the mask on to hide our identity. We got to get our name back on the map because they trying to frame us for the shit that they done did. We just trying to say to people. I just peep what I just did too. I mean, what they said. They said that. <laughs> they funny, bro. They literally said, bro, our last option is to kill people or use guns or something like that. Bagley, what do we have? A list of what Albion consider high value targets option. that are threats to the if peaceful we don't need to use our guns, then See here, a journalist, a and this one runs a community them. shelter. Good God, bar your doors. What the hell? All suspected of sowing car. rebellion or exhibiting tendencies no, we'll towards. <laughs> Albion is systematically arresting people even before they rise up. Jokes on them. This list can actually help us find like-minded allies willing to help us. Well done. We're already seeing results from what you've done. That list we found named a journalist in Camden who's been investigating Albion. We reached out and he's got information that can help us. I think you should meet with him. Forward me the coordinates. Damn, I didn't mean to hit you. Sorry. A little birdie told me you needed help. You're the crew that's been sticking it to Albion. Can't believe someone else is. Thought I was alone, right? Not doing much, just putting the word out. But you? Taking action, mate. Someone has to, don't they? Anyway, what have you got for us? Almost got clip finding this. All of Albion's operational data for the entire city. Convoy routes, surveillance targets, assets. It's all there. Thinking you can make good use of that. You'll get no argument from me. Here's a sample. Albion's closed King's Cross to the public, right? But what people don't know is that they're using it as their logistics center, materials, troops, whatever. A lot of it runs through there. You want to give the people a huge boost? Hit that place, put it out of commission, and you'll severely hamstring Albion's operations here in Camden. Hell, everywhere. Then that's our move. They got some type of tech point over here. I'm gonna try to get that really quick. We go through here. All units, all units, proceed to alarm location. Think the alarm's malfunctioning? I'll double check. Taste that. Damn. Could be an alarm malfunction or whoever triggered it wrong.
Mm. Man, I love their takedowns. That. Yo, keep coming, yo. Continuing patrol. You're out, Matt. I'm being suppressed. Oh, what am I doing? Do I get a better gun in this? Fucking hell! Taking fire! Oh. Like everything just shot some with my gun at. Need my little tech point. Oh, we gotta go upstairs. Okay. I've lost visual. Great. Fan out and find the target. Area clear. Moving. Drone. Up. Area search. <laughs> Damn. They're gone. Cancel the search. Oh, she had the passcode. Download that. She has the key to everything. Not I'm able to access anything. Yeah, man, this game is so filthy, man. You can literally hack anything. Even random pedestrians, they can just give you little information about them when you hack into their files, bro. Like, that's insane. Here we gotta unlock this. I don't know what that is. Not a spider bot, I guess you can have. I think. Okay, we got our little tech point. Let's get out of here. And we had to do a lot for just that tech point. That's crazy. It's not a collectible.
Just explode this. I probably could have played that a little more safely. Let me call my car in. Actually, it's right across the street. We don't need our car. What am I doing? Can't believe Albion's no operational of plans are just what we needed to really get some traction. We'll have to take a close look at this. Now, how do we take King's Cross offline? Albion's housed a massive hot. To that generator ain't gonna be easy. They've locked it up tighter since I last saw. Suggestions? My news drones are still in here. They should be functional. You can use one of them. Probably have better luck piloting it too, yeah? Well, causing a power surge in a hybrid powered generator isn't like making a toasting. We're going to need detailed specifications. Suppose we should check it out. Have a look at this. Cool, looks bloody complicated. News he's got a pretty functional camera. Would a picture do you, Bagley? It would indeed. According to this, there's an override code that'll get us into the generator's system. Drone to hack this, bro. Use certain files that we need. That's so cool. That's so cool, man. Literally. Not gonna catch me, buddy. That's it. Use the code on the generator, and I can trigger a power surge. It should be enough to take King's Cross offline, and the rail system too. Here we go. Literally can hack anything, bro. <laughs> Using drones, spiders, cameras, devices. Like, that's so cool. We got a gold mine of information out of St. Pancras. Albion convoys, informants, gear, you name it. Everything we need to ignite the people of London, like we did in Camden. Derail Albion's operations and give the people a reason to rise up, borough by borough. The more we do that, the more we'll get allies flocking to the cause. We'll show London that DedSec is here for them. That was off the chain, mate. I knew DedSec weren't the bad guys Albion was saying. Now the rest of Camden will too. Thanks. Thanks. Now that you've shown the borough what DedSec is really all about, there are going to be folks wanting to join up. A lot of people have been looking for a way to fight back. In fact, there's one in particular I suspect will contact you very soon. I happen to know they're champing at the bit. At this point, I think we'll take all comers. DedSec needs people. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed part one of Watch Dogs Legions. Like I said, this was my first live commentary. Um, so, yeah, we're going to get better at this, though. I mean, you know, it takes practice, but it doesn't matter what anybody's opinion is or how you talk or how you sound. Just You got to just be yourself. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed Watch Dogs Legions. This was part one. We'll be bringing you guys part two soon. Thank you, and peace out. It's your boy, Kobe.